Perhaps the biggest pop star on the planet is performing in London today, and you better believe security is tight at Wembley Stadium after Taylor Swift's concerts were canceled in Vienna last week. That's where investigators foiled an Islamic State inspired attack. But today the show goes on and Tina Krause with CBS News joins us live from London. Tina, thank you for your time. What is the atmosphere like right now at Wembley Stadium? Hey, Jeff. Well, right now in a rainy London, the skies just opened up and started pouring at the end of the concert. But you can still see Swifties over my shoulder. They are over there singing Swifty songs, singing Taylor songs. They are so excited. Um, they told me it was exhilarating, the concert tonight. So many of these fans, 90,000 packed Wembley Stadium for this sold out concert. And they were so happy, delighted, they said, that Taylor chose to stand fearless despite these security threats after her three gigs were canceled in the Austrian capital of Vienna last week. And obviously that was a sad turn of events, what happened in Vienna after those three shows were canceled from a terror threat. Did you see or notice a strong showing of security in London around the, around the stadium? We did. Um, closer to the stadium, definitely. We noticed also there was no tailgating. If you're not familiar with that term, that is tailgating Taylor Swift style, where crowds who don't have tickets gather right outside the stadium and they sing songs and they trade friendship bracelets. We saw about 40,000 of Swifties doing that in Munich in Germany earlier this summer, but that was not allowed because they had much tighter security tonight, extra ticket checks, only one bag allowed in, but the, you were allowed to bring in as many uh, friendship bracelets as you like. <laughs> of course, of course. And London is just a major hub there in Europe, a special city. You know, what, what makes this location, this city, um, such a great backdrop for an event like this? Well, you know, for Taylor Swift, um, it was back in 2017, that song London Boy that she wrote. And, you know, she talked about home is where the heart is, but said, God, I love London. And these English Swifties, she said, God, I love England, rather. And the England Swifties here, they love her right back. People talked about the true love they have for her. They love her bravery. They love her message. They love what she says to the young, what she says to the old, and what she says about life in the face of adversity. And then the the face of fear and the Manchester bombing that happened back in 2017 killed 22 people. People here said those fears still are very real, but they're trusting UK security teams learn something from that and they will keep them safe. Obviously, everything went off without a hitch and everyone's in good spirits. So I just have to ask you, this was probably a fun assignment now that it's like wrapping up. Uh, are you a Swifty fan or are you, are you having fun there too? Oh, well, you know what I have to say? It has not been a cruel summer. It's been a pretty awesome summer. Look at all of my friendship bracelets I got. And I'll tell you what, it has been a lot of fun. My nieces are very jealous back in the States. And I've got a little bit of FOMO now. I want to get inside to one of those concerts very soon. Well, you got some nice little souvenirs to give to your nieces. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Thank you so much. Tina Krause live for us in London yeah. this afternoon. Thank you again for your time.